Hello everyone! Happy Halloween! And welcome back to my Dose of Jossa YouTube channel. Ako po si Jossa and I am a self-proclaimed mermaid, wonderluster, solo traveler, lover of life, and pursuer of dreams. It's my first ever Halloween year sa YouTube and I'm beyond excited because I've always looked forward to Halloween all year round. It's one of my most favorite holidays ever, even though I know it's not considered as an official holiday. But it's that one time of the year that you get to put on your favorite Halloween costumes, be whoever you want to be, dress up however you want to, and live your fantasy even just for a day. Halloween for several reasons but really what I love the most about it is you get to put on your favorite Halloween costume and dress up as your favorite character from movies, TV shows, and pop culture in general. And obviously man, with some of the photos that I've shared during my introduction, I've had quite a few Halloween costumes for the past few years before the pandemic. You know, I've dressed up as Tinkerbell, Elsa from Frozen, Harley Quinn, the bride from Ready or Not. But really, hands down, my most favorite Halloween costume ever was my Sailor Moon outfit back in 2017 because I got to do it in Tokyo, Japan during one of my solo trips. And as we all know, in Japan, people go all out in their cosplay. You know, they love dressing up and they love putting on their costumes. So it's truly a once in a lifetime experience that I will never forget. So that was truly special for me. Now for today's dose, we're also gonna make it extra special because I will finally dress up as one of my most favorite WWE superstars of the modern era, the one and only goddess of the WWE, Twisted Bliss herself, Alexa Bliss. Now, if you really know me, I'm very passionate about three things in life. One, I'm very passionate about solo traveling. Two, I'm very passionate about being a mermaid. And three, I'm very passionate about my love for WWE and wrestling. And I've always wanted to dress up as Alexa Bliss for the past few years. And I'm very excited that this year I finally get to do it as my first ever, you know, Halloween costume slash makeup tutorial here in my Dose of Jossa YouTube channel. So please make sure you click that subscribe button, like and share my videos, and also ring that notification bell button for more doses of Jossa in the future. So if you're ready to see how I turn this into this, so just keep on watching. right into the makeup, syempre not only do you have to look the part, but you also have to dress the part for Halloween. Kaya naman a few weeks ago, I bought a lot of Alexa Bliss branded merchandise from wweshop.com, which is the official online store of WWE. You know, it has a lot of merchandise from WWE superstars and wrestlers that will really help us complete the transformation for our Alexa Bliss Halloween costume this year. So the packages are finally here and this has all been sitting in my house for quite some time now and I'm just about ready to open them up and share all of the Alexa Bliss merchandise inside to you guys. Now you just realized that this is my first ever unboxing video here sa aking Dose of Jossa YouTube channel. Kaya naman I can't wait. Let's go ahead and unbox what's inside these packages. Now, let's start with the smallest package. Actually, hindi ko na rin maalala kung ano yung mga in-order ko because this has been several weeks ago. So, I have here her scissors. So, we're gonna open it up and see what's inside. Here we go. I think, oh, yes. Ayan, naalala ko na siya. So, in here, we have... Ayan, so this is the Alexa Bliss Play Pain Smiley T-shirt and this retails at 1,055 pesos. So it's a little but um, it looks like it's in good quality. So I'm going to take it later to complete our Alexa Bliss Halloween costume. One, another thing that's inside, which is I cannot wait to try the Alexa Bliss Play Pain Replica gloves and these retails at 1077 pesos 
Actually, buksan na natin siya. So, si Alexa Bliss, she loves wearing her gloves as part of her costume or ring gear. And this is the latest pair of gloves that she's wearing. It's called Play Pain. And it looks like this. Ayan. Let's hope it fits. Oh my gosh, this looks like the actual one. Wow. Okay, how do I... I'm wearing Velcro. Ah, I'm excited! Ako. Wait, play. Okay. Ano siya? Ha? Huh? Tama ba to? Wait lang. Parang pareho siyang right-handed na glove. Ah, hindi lang ako maruna. <laughs> ayan, o oh, ganun pala siya. Okay, tama. Here, ayan, ayan siya. Play pain. Ayan, kitang-kita naman na medyo nag-struggle tayo with the play pain gloves. But we finally figured it out. Ayan, so it's so, 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 so today and we're gonna wear it throughout the rest of our unboxing. Next up, we have this slightly bigger box and let's open up and see what's inside. So, ganito talaga ako mag-open ng box using a large um, pair of scissors. Excited. <laughs> What's inside? This I oh wow! Ayan ako more merchandise. Okay, first up we have another um, Alexa Bliss play pain um, smiley shirt. So bumili ako ng dalawa because I plan to use the second one for my jogging and whenever I run. And then also we have another pair of Alexa Bliss gloves. Now, to siya. These are the gloves that she wore, I think, back in 2018, 2017 to 2019. Ayan, mahilig siya mag ng mga Alexa Bliss skeleton gloves. Pero I'm saving this up for, you know, a future video about her. And then also, one of, oh my gosh, wow, this is really one of my favorites. Uh, a replica of the WWE Raw Women's Championship belt. Ayan. So, medyo nakakapagod pala mag unbox <laughs> But here it is, ayan siya. And I think this retails at uh, 1,346 pesos. And the Little Miss Bliss Blue Replica Gloves, this one retails at uh, 606 pesos. So here it is, ayan. So this two medjo, I will, I'm planning to save them for a future Alexa Bliss inspired makeup video, which you have to watch out soon. Last but not the least for our unboxing, this big box right here. And I think I know kung anong laman nito. And let's go ahead and open. Nakakapagod pala mag-unboxing, guys. Medyo. Um, and I don't know how other vloggers do it gracefully, pero it's not as easy as it looks. Ayan. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Ayan, nakikita ko na siya. Ah! Oh my gosh! Ang laki niya! Oh my gosh! Ang laki! Okay, this is the Alexa Bliss Lily Plush Doll. Uh, for all of you guys who are not familiar with Alexa Bliss right now, her character is more of a creepy, kind of like supernatural, childlike, you know, possessed version of her. And she has this doll named Lily, which helps her during her wrestling matches. She plays mind games with the opponents of Alexa Bliss. It's bigger than what I thought it would be. As far as size go, it looks like it's in really good quality. And I cannot wait to take some photos with her for my Halloween costume this year. This Alexa Bliss Lily plush doll retails at 1,616 pesos. I think this is the most expensive one from all the items that I bought from www.shop.com. But obviously, man, that it's worth it. Ang ganda niya pang display and also pang laro lang. So there you have it. That's pretty much it for our unboxing of all of the Alexa Bliss uh, merchandise that I bought from www.shop.com. Now, let me go ahead and freshen up. I'm just gonna wipe and wash my face clean because up next, we're gonna do our Alexa Bliss makeup tutorial. All right, so let's get started with our Alexa Bliss Halloween makeup tutorial and as you guys know I love starting my makeup with a good skin prep and this one I will be using the Lux Organics Aloe Vera and Snail Soothing Gel for all types of skin. I bought this two months ago from Watson's for 219 pesos. As you can see it's one of my most favorite skincare products as of late. It really made my skin a lot more brighter and lighter and it evened out my complexion. 
is really one of my favorite skincare products. And also, nakikita nyo naman with 300 ml. Um, marami pa siyang product na natitira. So, sobrang sulit yung purchase. And what I love about this is you can really tell that um, this aloe vera and snail soothing gel really tightened me. <laughs> tightened me. <laughs> Sorry. Tightened my pores. Sacking skin for that firming and more glowing effect. And what I love about this is nilalagi ko muna siya sa ref before I use it. So that way, pag inapply ko siya sa aking skin, is sobrang living. So we're going to prep our skin with the Lux Organics Aloe Vera and Snail Soothing Gel. Siyempre, we're gonna put on a lot of makeup today. Medyo heavy ang ating coverage. So we want to make sure that our face and our skin is prepped for all the makeup. We are going to show some love to our neck area and I will be using this product from R Top R. This is the Neck Firming and Rejuvenation Cream and I found this in Lazada for only 161 pesos and I've been trying it out for several days now and so far maganda naman yung effect niya. It claims to have anti-wrinkle and fine lines repair properties. So alam niyo naman, hindi naman tayo bumabata. So as early as now, we should be taking care of the skin on our face and also our neck area. And I'm just gonna put a piece amount on my finger and apply it on my neck and then just gently massage your neck area with the product in an upward motion. Hindi ko alam kung effective yung upward motions pero you know it helps para ma prevent um, wrinkles and any fine lines from developing in your neck area. And then we are going to start priming our skin and I will be using once again this silicone primer from Detail Cosmetics. Alam niyo naman na medyo pang full tank at pang malakasa ng makeup ni Alexa Bliss. So dapat primed and ready with our skin for makeup. Ayan, so we're finally ready to start our actual makeup look. And see, Alexa Bliss, she has been through a lot of character changes in her entire WWE career. But the makeup look that we're going for today is her current dark, twisted version of Alexa Bliss. So we're going to be using a lot of dark colors, a lot, a lot of black and gray shades. Starting with foundation, her foundation in her current WWE look is a lot lighter compared to her actual skin tone. So I will be using and mixing together this two foundation. First, we have this Life Proof Airy Serum from BLK Cosmetics in the shade Vanilla. And also my usual foundation, which is the L'Oreal Infallible 24-Hour Fresh Wear in the shade Sand to achieve that foundation look from Alexa Bliss. And then using a damp beauty blender, let's go ahead and mix those two foundations together and apply it on our skin. I started watching WWE, I think, back when I was ele in elementary. It was more than 20 years ago, and the first wrestling match that I saw was this mixed tag team match between Sable and Mark Miro versus Luna and Goldust. I instantly fell in love watching women wrestle, and that was love at first sight for me. I fell in love with women's wrestling, and then eventually my love for WWE, which was WWE back then um, grew to loving the entire show and uh, loving the rest of the superstars on the roster and I just love the idea of the female wrestlers kicking butt and also looking good and beautiful and sexy at the same time. I've been a fan since then. I've consistently followed WWE product and programming. Sobrang fan na fan talaga ako ng WWE storylines and also the superstars and wrestlers. So that was my love story with WWE. Now, I will be using the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer, one of my all-time favorite concealers in the shade Light. I will be applying it in my under eye area. 
down the bridge of my nose, upper lip area. And I think it's one thing that really surprises people when they get to know me is that I'm a huge hardcore fan of WWE and wrestling. Like I know all of the superstars, I know all of the storylines, I know all of the wrestling history. I've even played um, WWE video games year after year after year. Uh, I always made sure that I have the copy of the wrestling game for that year. And one thing that particularly attracted me to Alexa Bliss was the fact that she reminded me of a modern version of Trish Stratus. Like she's really good at promos and not to mention her wrestling skills are top notch. Like she can really portray her wrestling persona to 100%. She has a lot of charisma, a lot of attitude, and that's really one thing that I particularly like about her. So Alexa Bliss uh, first signed with WWE in their developmental territory, which is the WWE NXT back in 2013. I believe she made her television debut the year after in 2014 where she played this huge baby face. You know, she has this glitter sparkle fairy gimmick and she would blow glitter to the crowd and everybody loves her. And then she got injured for a while, made her return in 2015 in WWE NXT where she managed the tag team of Blake and Murphy, former NXT tag team champions. And she she was a bad girl. She was helping Blake and Murphy win their matches uh, through cheating and distracting the referee. So she played the bad girl or the heel in wrestling really well. Like you can tell that the crowd really hated her for always interfering. And then she made her main roster debut in the WWE draft back in 2016. She was drafted to one of the main shows which is SmackDown Live. And from there she started this gimmick of being the god goddess of WWE, which goddess direct translation in Tagalog is Josa, so how appropriate. And she was this mean girl and she would always say mean things to other wrestlers. And then eventually she captured her first SmackDown Live women's title, defeating Becky Lynch in WWE TLC Table Flatters and Chairs pay-per-view. And from then her career just started skyrocketing. She was winning women's championships left and right. Alexa Bliss was the first woman to hold the Raw and SmackDown Live Women's Championships. You know, she's also a former women's tag team champions with Nikki Cross. And then fast forward to 2021, you know, she started this whole storyline with Bray Wyatt as The Fiend where she got possessed and became this darker, twisted version of herself which is what we're doing right now. And then we are just going to set and bake our cream products with the Nichido Final Setting Powder in the shade Ivory Glow. And I will be using um, the, one of my newest mermaid brushes. I like the mermaid brushes because it really helps with the application of my setting powder especially underneath the eye area. So going back to Alexa Bliss, you know, right now she is playing this twisted version of herself and then she started introducing this supernatural creepy doll named Lily. So at the show today and Lily has been helping me with showing you the makeup products that I'm using in this video. And then Lily would also help her win her matches like distracting her opponents and then also doing some supernatural things, playing mind games and all that stuff. And Lily became so popular that eventually WWE made and started selling merchandise of her and putting her on t-shirts. What's not to love about a creepy doll, right? I'm just gonna put this Nichido Final Setting Powder all over our face and let that bake for a couple of minutes. eyebrows real quick with my favorite eyebrow product which is the BLK Cosmetics Universal Brow Stick. And then since we will be using a lot of dark eyeshadows for the Alexa Bliss Halloween makeup, I will be applying this MAC Paint Pot in contemplative state to make sure that all of the eyeshadow products stick on our eyelids. And now we're finally ready for our 
our eyeshadow look for this Alexa Bliss Halloween makeup tutorial and for today's video we will be using this collaboration between MAC Cosmetics and Disney. This is the Cruella to be kind eyeshadow palette inspired by the live action movie of Cruella starring Emma Stone and this retails at 2750 pesos. So it's a bit more expensive but it's packaging as what you guys can see. The box pa lang, it has a lot of Cruella and fashion inspired designs. But in reality, Alexa Bliss is a huge fan of Disney. She loves going to Disney parks. She even collects Disney mugs. And there are also a lot of times when she has worn a lot of Disney character inspired wrestling gear to her matches. And I think it's only fitting that since we're doing an Alexa Bliss video, there has to be a little Disney product in there. I have brought you guys closer so you can see how I apply my eyeshadows. The first shade that we will be using from this eyeshadow palette is this shade called Gesso. So this is a vivid white matte shade. And we are going to put this in our brow bone area so that way hindi matapunan ng dark colors ng ating brow bone. It still pops underneath all the dark and smoky makeup. And I'm just gonna use a shader brush, a flat shader brush for that, and apply it on our brow bone. And then up next, we are going to use this Max Factor Skylight Eyeshadow Palette. And then we will be using this gray shade over here as our transition shade. So that way, we have a dimension sa ating black smoky eyeshadow look for Alexa Bliss. And I'm just going to use this blender brush from Anne Clute's brushes, by the way. And just put this shade underneath the brow bone. We're gonna go even darker with our eyeshadow look and we will go back to the MAC Cosmetics Disney's Cruella to be kind eyeshadow palette. I'm using a rounded blender brush and dip into this black matte shade called Carbon so we can start smoking out our eyeshadow look. So we're going to apply the shade on our outer corner of the eyelid and then slowly work your way into the inner corner and really it's about working slowly but surely and building that shadow on your eyelids. Cosmetics Disney's Cruella to be kind eyeshadow palette. I'm going to use once again the black matte shade and I will be further defining the black on our eyeshadow. As what you guys can see, see Alexa Bliss, her current look right now, her current eyeshadow look is very snatched upwards. And to achieve that effect, you can use an eyeshadow guard. But if you don't have um, a budget to buy an eyeshadow guard, you can just use any plain old card that you find at home. And this time, I will be using this uh, old uh, SM gift card and I'm just gonna put it on the edge or the outer corner of my eyelid and then apply our eyeshadow there. And then using a crease brush, we're just gonna put the black eyeshadow in the outer corner and then all over the crease and then extending it to the inner corner of the eye. We're just gonna use 
that uh, crease brush to further define the inner corner of the eye. And at this point, don't worry if it looks messy and all over the place. Because even the makeup of Alexa Bliss on television, it's also messy to portray her twisted, darker version of herself. Plus, it's Halloween makeup, so no need to be precise and sharp. You know, it just has to be fun. Now we're taking our eyeshadow look a step darker and this time I will be using LA Girls Gel Liner in Very Black and using a shader brush from Anne Clothes Brushes. We're going to apply that all over our eyelid. Makeup look, we're not gonna use any eyeliner because obviously, masyado ng dark ang ating eyeshadow look. So, we're just gonna settle for this LA Girl Very Black Gel Liner. And then, going back to those edges, we're just gonna use that brush for our black eyeshadow to further blend the gel liner that we applied on our lid. So I brushed off some of the excess setting powder underneath my eye because we are going to start working on our lower lash line and then using a smudger brush, I'm going to dip back into this black matte shade from the MAC Cosmetics Disney Cruella To Be Kind eyeshadow palette and we will be putting that on our lower lash line. Max Factor Skylight Eyeshadow Palette and dip into this black shade here because we will be further smoking down our lower lash line. Cosmetics Disney Cruella To Be Kind eyeshadow palette. We're gonna dip into this silver frost shade called The Villionaire and we are going to highlight and put this all over our brow bone. look we are going to put on our mascara and I will be using my Nichido 7x curl mascara and then afterwards we're gonna put on our eyelashes and I will be right back and we're back with me wearing my false eyelashes and I'm not sure if you guys can tell na kasi ako ng false eyelashes today because my eyeshadow look is so dark and smoky pero I went with more dramatic false eyelashes because it's Halloween and Alexa Bliss loves wearing her huge false eyelashes while wrestling in the ring so that's the look that we're going for and up next is contour and this is a part that we are going to slightly improvise because if you look at Alexa Bliss's um, contour you know, she uses a lot of grays and blacks for her contour shade. And obviously, mahirap makahanap ng black and gray contour shades in the stores here in the Philippines. So we're going to go and use the Max Factor eyeshadow palette from earlier. And using a multi-purpose uh, blending brush, we're going to dip into the black and gray shade in the middle of this palette. And let's hope for the best. We will be putting it and using it as our contour on our cheeks. And then we're just gonna put that on the upper corner of our cheek area and extend it inwards. And then using our beauty blender from earlier, we're just gonna slowly blend that contour shade para hindi masyadong harsh ang ating cheeks. with blending my black and gray contour because it's hard to blend because the shades are for an eyeshadow and it's not really a contour shade but I feel like I got this to a place now. okay it's okay acceptable um, and up next we're going to add warmth to this face and this time I will be using this features and shade contour palette and I will be using these two brown shades as my blush
to use the Features and Shades Contour Palette again to contour the bridge of my nose and as what you can see, see Alexa Bliss, she has such a great looking nose so we have to make sure that our nose is contoured to perfection. And then up next we are going to highlight and I will go back and use my Barbie BYS makeup palette and I will dip into my one of my favorite highlighting shades and then just put it on the upper area of her cheeks. And then Alexa Bliss, she loves her highlighter. She loves everything sparkly and glittery. So don't feel like you're going overboard with your highlighter. If ever you feel na masyadong maraming highlighter yung inapply nyo, you can always go back with your beauty blender and just blend everything in. Alexa Bliss Halloween makeup look, we will be putting on a black lipstick because the Alexa Bliss, she loves wearing black lipstick in her makeup. And I will be using this liquid lipstick from Alodia Beauty in the shade Black Mage. And I bought this for 475 pesos in Lazada. It was really difficult for me to find a black lipstick out in the stores here in Metro Manila. So I'm glad that Alodia came up with this product. And the applicator is small and very easy to use. It allows you more control when applying this black liquid lipstick. It is a bit drying on the lips as with all dark pigmented liquid lipstick. However, it's very easy to remove. I've tried this just yesterday and I was able to easily remove it with a makeup wipe and then by washing my face. face with a BLK Cosmetics Skin Hydrating Ultra Fine Mist to set everything in place and then I will be wearing all of the Alexa Bliss merchandise that I bought from WWEshop.com and I will be putting on the Alexa Bliss wig to fully transform myself as Alexa Bliss this Halloween. And if you want to see the full transformation, join lang kayo because Lily and I will be right back. makeup tutorial for my first ever Halloween here on YouTube. Hopefully you enjoy kayo and for more videos like this, please make sure you click that subscribe button to my Dose of Jossa YouTube channel, like and share my videos, and also ring that notification bell button for more doses of Jossa in the future. Special thanks to my lovely friends from Wigaloo PH and Hair on Point PH for providing my wig for today's video. And once again, ako po ni si Jossa and Lily na nagsasabi sa inyong lahat that we are all mermaids in this ocean called life. So just keep on swimming and happy Halloween!